Hi guys, how are you doing? This is Armand Cruz again and welcome to another Property House Tour. So today I'm right now here in Calamba, Laguna to show you around a new project that has been recently launched last November by one of uh, the country's top developers. So before we continue, if you're watching this video on YouTube, kindly hit the subscribe button also like this video and also don't forget to click on the notification bell and if you're watching this video on Facebook, kindly follow our Facebook page and give this video a thumbs up. So today, panibagong araw, panibagong house tour na naman po tayo. And nandito po tayo ngayon, in Kalamba, Laguna, Maya pa Kalundubang Exit. Just to give you an idea, this project, ang pangalan na po ng project na to is First Park Homes in Kalamba, Laguna. Ang developer po niya is Sea Century Properties. Now, uh, if some of you most probably is familiar with the developer si Century po ay kilala bilang isang high-end developer especially in Metro Manila and also other parts of the Philippines but right now they are developing one of their affordable projects which what which they call right now is first first park homes in Calamba Laguna uh, actually uh, para po sa mga malamang may nakakalam na rin ang ibang video nito yung video niya is uh, si Piolo Pascual yung naging first endorser niya so most probably from here po kayo. So today, uh, this I'll be dividing this video into two parts. Magkakaroon po tayo ng two parts. The first part is magpapakita po sa, sa inyo is, uh, which is today, itong video na ito, papakita ko sa inyo is end unit. End unit po na standalone and also end unit na combined po siya para dun sa mga gusto na magkaroon ng end unit na medyo mas malaki. Now for our second video, ang ipapakita ko sa inyo is your inner unit tapos yung inner unit na uh, ginawa pong three bedrooms. Okay? So tara po. Simulan na natin. Ikot na po tayo doon sa mismong yun. So, let's start. Ito na po yung ano, just to, before tayo mag, uh, pag, mag ikot doon sa mismong unit. I'll just show you yung facade ng mismong property. So ganyan na po yung design niya. Um, once this is turned over, uh, wala po tayong modification pwedeng gawin niyan. It should be the same color. Ang gandahan naman ng property to, kaya ko rin siya nagustahan, is number one, yung fencing niya, yung nakita niyo yung bakod na yan, ito, also tong gate, kasama po siya sa turnover. So, technically, pagka turnover po sa inyo, since complete finish din po itong bahay na to, wala na po yung kailangan isipin, kundi gamit lang dadaling nyo, tapos siguro pag may si gusto nyo magkaroon ng garden, landscaping, and also siguro interior na lang din. Okay? So, for this video, like what I said, I'll be showing you around uh, their uh, end or corner unit. So, specifications po tayo. Uh, minimum lot area po nito for an end unit is 60 square meters. And for the corner unit, ang minimum lot area po nito is 67 square meters. So, for this one, ito nakikita nyo, this is 82 square meters. Ang floor area ng buong bahay, standard po siya regardless kung inner yan or... Uh, end unit or corner unit this is 40 square meters with 2 bedrooms and 1 toilet and bath pero para po dun sa nagtatanong alam ko kasi syempre maganda ni may CR sa taas meron po siyang abang na magkaroon kayo ng CR sa second floor okay so tara po pasok po tayo dun sa mismong unit so ang height ng fence siguro wala pa siyang 1 meter medyo mababa lang siya and then ito na ganito na mismo yung, guard, yung, yung gate natin ganyan na ganyan na mismo yan so, uh, ang turnover unit, turnover is I believe ganito na rin yata. Okay, ganito, ganito na rin. Okay. Ang size, ang size na to, this can fit a small car or yung siguro mga small size na vehicles like Swift, um, Vigo, o along those lines. Okay, so okay na rin. So, if you have a bigger car, siguro I would uh, advise that you... Uh, siguro get a different unit hindi ko sigurado kung anong work around nila kasi ginawa nila to for their ano, for small size vehicles so okay so since this is a corner unit you have ample space dito sa labas okay to have your own garden okay so depende na sa inyo yun kung anong gagawin yung garden or pwedeng extendan nyo siya okay so it depends on you okay so dito naman sa ligod dito yung provision niya for um, pwedeng dirty kitchen, pwedeng laundry area. Okay? So, very simple lang ginawa niya landscaping. Uh, very achievable kasi uh, hindi masyado mabongga. So, at least uh, hindi siya. 
Okay? Binibigyan ka talaga ng idea kung talaga magiging itsura ng bahay mo. Okay? So, as we enter, this is a steel door. Okay? So, para sa price, actually, I suggest you guys check yung pricing niya. I always post the price sa ano, description box. Magugulat kayo. So, as we enter, usually, nasanay tayo ng nakikita natin is yung uh, dito sa right side, usually, nakikita natin is yung living area. So, since ando lang siya, 40 square meters, yung ginawa niya, ang peg niya is ito, pagkaharap mo, this is your dining area. And then, sa tapat niya, or sa ilalim ng stairs, will be your living area. Okay? And then, ito yung, actually, ang flooring niya, ito nakikita niyo, ganyan na siya, vinyl planks po siya. And yung walls po natin, as you can see, it's white walls. Ganyan na po siya. Guys, yung mga nakikita niyo yung windows, dahil... Because this is a, an end unit or a corner unit, may window po tayo sa side. Pero mamaya, makikita nyo, or sa second video, makikita nyo yung differences niya. Okay, this is your uh, kitchen. Hindi po ganyan yung turnover niya. Okay? So, maybe I'll post a photo. Or if you message me, I'll send you a photo of one picture ng actual turnover unit niya. Okay? So, downstairs, we also have one toilet and bath. Ito po siya. Ayan po yung magiging itsura niya. Or turn over. So, ayan po. So, let's go upstairs. Nakat po tayo. Okay, so, ganito na yung mismo magiging stairs niya. Hindi na siya magkakalilid sa actual turn over. Okay, again, if you want to see the actual turn over, no, mismong unit na to as... I'll send it to you as long as you message me through Viber or WhatsApp. So upstairs, we have two bedrooms. Okay, so it's just the right, right size. Tama lang siya. Okay. So ito po yung master bedroom or yung bedroom one. Ganyan po yung maging intro. Again, since this is an end unit, merong, room, merong bintana dito. Okay, lamig na aircon. And then this is the second bedroom. And push up. It's just the right size. If you're a starting family, or hindi ganong kalakay family, family of three or four, it is okay. Okay? Oh, so actually, San Arman, San Goy lalagi yung CR ko dito. So you can make this as a door. Pedin yung siyang going door. And then ito, straight siya, diretso. May nakaabang na dito sa likod niya na nakita niya yan nakaabang na siya for CR kaya ito kung makapansin ginawa nila ng jalo si yung bintana para mas madaling tanggalin and also i-convert to a CR so nakita niya may tubo na you know, may tubo na yung orange ay mag-focus mag-focus ka okay so ano na siya it's a good space for a CR sa second floor well, this is the first unit uh, punta naman tayo dun sa second unit. This is a combined unit. If you want to have a bigger unit, kasi 40 square meters ka lang siya. So it can only fit, or hindi siya, it's okay. Okay size siya for 2, 3 to 4 people. Pero pag naging 5 na tayo, or medyo dumami na, kunyari may guest ka, hindi na siya ganun kaluwag. So ngayon, I'll be showing you around yung combined unit niya. Pupunta lang tayo dun ngayon. Okay, so laka tayo, medyo mainit. Okay, kita ba ako? Madilim. So, ayan, so ito, punta tayo. Actually, hindi ko pa siya napapasok. So, first time ko siyang bividyohan. At first time ko siyang papasokan. Okay? So, ayan po siya. Ayan po siya. Continuity of it, para lang medyo hindi can, uh, can yung mga videos. Kasi papa, hindi ko puro can. So, itong unit na to, kakabasa ko lang, it's 80 square meters. And then, ang floor area, minimum lot area is around 100. Tignan natin, tabi tayo. 104. So, okay na rin na size. And actually, you can actually park two cars uh, dyan sa unahan. So, ang pinag-combine itong dalo, isang end at isang inner. Okay? So, for the inner, hindi ko sure kung pwede tayo mag-combine. Pero, syempre, kung mag gusto magko-combine kayo, maganda na isang end tapos isang inner. Okay, so tara, um, let's explore. This is the first time I'm gonna see this unit. So, tara po, pasok tayo. Okay? So again, sa front, 
uh, frontage na around mga 3 to 4 meters pero next start yung gate medyo angat na konti so talagang kasha dito is yung uh, small size vehicles okay so akin nasa actually nandito tayo sa higher part ng kalamba so for this unit as you can see uh, combined unit siya so uh, ginawa niya na 3 bedroom sa taas tapos ah may dalawang CR okay so may dalawang CR sa baba and then yung master bedroom uh, malaki siya okay so let's go inside tapos tayo wow okay ganda so as we enter as you can see this is the this is the living area naki ng living area okay so if you have guests or medyo mahi or mahilig kayo mag-invite ng people to your house, as you can see, this can be, or this is what you can do with first part. You can actually combine two units para mas malaki. So it's actually 80 square meters. So isipin mo yung ibabang floor niya, living area lang. So this one, ang pinag niya, nagkaroon ng sariling um, CR for the guest. Okay? Which is good kasi at least uh, meron ko pa rin yung personal restroom and then downstairs ayan, ginawa niya is oh, ayan, so ginawa niya is uh, naglagay siya mirror, tapos sliding door siya leading to the dining area so, ang laki yung oh, dining area ang ganda niya, oh so, very nice okay. so, this is your um uh, kitchen, so uh, parang nag L type siya. So ito yung mismong ito. Uh, lalagay ng, ng ref. And then downstairs we have another CR. Kasi nga, dalawa yung CR. Pwede nang combine siya. Where's I am? Pwede na natin two CRs. Ayan. Okay, so let's go upstairs. Alam tayo bang ano? Ngayon ko lang nakita. Pero I like the size. I don't know. Comment down below if you like the size of the this unit, this actual unit. Okay, so, tinanggal, ang ginawa sa kabila, tinanggal na isang stairs. Ngayon, uh, niretain na lang itong isa, tapos dito nilagay lahat, yung kitchen and also dining area. Okay, so, ito yung uh, bedroom natin. Okay, so ito yung bedroom one. Okay, maganda. Pwede na. Okay. Good size, can fit to five, six or six people. Pwede na. Okay, this is our bedroom two. Okay, and then excited now kasi nakita ko yung master bedroom. Sinapok niya lahat yung buong floor ng second floor ng kabilang unit. So, naglagay siya ng parang mini office area dito. Okay, where in nga naman, you can do your work or kaya if you have kids, they can study here. Tapos nilagyan niya ng library. Ayan po siya. So this is the master bedroom. Okay, so bigger version. Maganda. Ampo space. Maluwag. Okay. So again, comment down below if you like this unit. Okay. Like lang naman eh. Hindi ko naman siya na bibili niyo. So, uh, and then, uh, guys, if you want to see this unit in the actual, don't hesitate to contact me. Okay. So in po, thank you very much for watching this video of First Part Homes Kalamba. I hope you like this unit and also yung first unit na pinagayot ko sa inyo. Uh, if you have more questions, kindly contact me in the details I have provided in the description. And also, I suggest that you follow me sa mga social media accounts ko. Uh, uh, ano pa ba? Yun lang. So if you have, again, if you have more questions or I actually want to invite you to see this unit in the actual kasi uh, a video can never do justice kung gano'ng kaganda ang isang unit or gano'ng ka, ka, ka yung quality niya hindi niyo malalaman talaga unless nakita niyo. And hopefully, ako ang mapilay niyong agent. So yun lang po. Uh, this has been Arman Cruz and hope to see you soon sa next house tour natin which is, which will be posted two days after this. So yun lang po. Don't forget to like this video. Subscribe to our channel. If you're on Facebook, follow our Facebook page and like this or give this video a thumbs up. Yun lang po and hope to see you soon. Bye bye guys.